exchange of command ceremony and parade. A crowd gathered under the early morning sun while hundreds of airmen, soldiers, sailors and marines assembled on Goodfellow's parade field for a time-honored military tradition, a change of command ceremony. While it's a simple and direct ceremony, it can be emotional, especially for the outgoing commander. I love these people. My kids and my wife make fun of me. In fact, my sons asked me, is the job of a wing commander to walk around the base and talk to people? In the end it is, because those conversations in the BX and on the fire training pad, and at the softball games and at first Fridays, are where I got to know these amazing airmen, and they got to know me. And those mutual investments will stand the test of time. And it will be one of the most difficult steps I have ever taken to pass the guide on to Colonel Mills. Second Air Force Commander, Major General Robert Labruda, transferred command from Colonel Michael Downs to Colonel Ricky Mills. What I can tell you and, and the men and women of the 17th Training Wing that uh, after this change of command, taking care of airmen, soldiers, sailors, Marines, and their families will be the first thing on my mind, and it will be the last thing on my mind when I relinquish command. Colonel Mills also expressed his goals for the wing. It will be about continuity and striving for excellence to continue to move the ball up the field in the same capacity that you guys did during your tour here. But if you chase perfection, you can catch excellence. Colonel Mills is a native to San Angelo, Texas, graduating from Central High School. Air Force Staff Sergeant Anthony Hetlich, Goodfellow Air Force Base, Texas.